This is Manor Lords Part 3. I, that's right, am a Lord of the Manor. This is me. This is me. For some reason, I'm, I love Christmas. I don't know why I'm dressed like this. And this is me running around my little manor. Or I, I'm sorry, my little town. These are all the peasants working very lazily, I might add. Very, very lazily. But I do like that this, this game has this. This is the manor here. This is the manor. This is where I live and a bunch of other families randomly live. Um, yeah, you can walk around your settlement, but uh, this is where I live. This is the manor. Um, and then this is my actual, my actual town. So we've made enough, like it's really hard to, I know it's really hard to tell what is what. Um, meaning like, hey, here's the clay furnace and uh, here's the stone cutter camp. Because all, all the buildings look very, very similar. But uh, this is the way it would have looked back then, I guess. <laughs> There's the tavern that no one's in. Um... The sewer system. Oh, there's no sewer system. Are you crazy? The sewer system is the ground. Uh, <laughs> Merky Lee, <laughs> gifted to Tech Titan. Merk, do it. I think you already have a. Uh, pretty sure you already have, a, um, a peasant. Correct, Merk. Let me make sure that. Let me make sure. Let me make sure that we've got a few empty, empty spots here. Because I've been doing a uh, naming peasants, naming peasants after <laughs> subs, but it looks like these are all full. I think. Yeah, these are all full. So we have to wait for new people to move in. There is no city prison, but there is a corpse pit. <laughs> There's the corpse pit. Um, and then also. Big development. I just took over this area as well. So I just took over Scoot! Scoot gifted to zero reaction. Zero reaction. Do something nice for somebody else. So I just took over. This took a long, long time to take over a second area. So now we have more areas to hunt. More areas to pick berries, which is good. Oh, and I need to build some roads actually out here as well. Um, so I'm going to build some roads out to these... Uh, there's a little clay deposit, a stone deposit, iron deposit. This is my militia over here. Still invincible. You can't call dibs on corpse pit duty, although you might end up getting uh, buried in the corpse pit, just so you know. Um, so I have to wait for people to move in before I can start naming people after subs, like I've been doing. Uh, roads? Okay. The nice thing about roads here is that they uh, don't cost anything, which is awesome. As, it's like maybe the one thing that this game allows that I think is great. So you can just build roads wherever you want. Uh, Dank Bong Ripper. Thanks for the Prime Dank Bong Ripper. Yeah, it's pretty great. So this is my new my new area. I need to send my oh nope nope. I need to send my spear spear boys back home here. And it's winter. It's currently February, but I do have six months of food and eleven months of fuel, which is good. Which is good. Uh, I need to. I do need to stockpile more fuel. So I'm probably going to need to build another forager hut. Do I already... Maybe... Well, maybe not. Let's just... Let's get going here. And zero months of sewers. And then... It, combat turns into RTS, but you really don't spend a lot of time in combat. At least I haven't yet. So here's my little little guys going going about their business. I thought I had, uh, 
I really thought that I had some extra families to name, but I don't. What's up, Easy Eddie? Uh, also, I think I need to build another stable, possibly. Where's my stable? Did I move it? There's a saw pit. There it is. Wait a minute. I thought I named... So I have 116 peasants. And I need to level up burgage plots, the housing plots, to level 3. I need to level up level 3 to do this. So I need clothing, or more clothing stalls. Hmm. Uh, we can do... Did you unlock cannibalism yet? No. What's wrong with you? No, I didn't do any of that. I should probably make another hunting... Another hunting village or whatever. Hunting village there. And then that's... This is berries, right? Yeah. There we go. Okay. So these hunting village, the hunting village and the forager will get berries and get uh, meat for me. Storage is full. Oh, the mining pit. Yeah. Where am I? No, you cannot eat people. Thank God. I need to take. Oh, do I? Hey, wait, hold on. I think I took over this area because of farming too. Um, can I make a, a big, yeah, yes. So the green is really good. The green is, it means like it's the most fertile that it could possibly be. So we're going to make a giant farm. We're going to make a massive, massive farm in the green here. Uh, this is going to take a thousand years. Hopefully this will help. Hopefully this will help actually bring in more uh, more food. That's right. Bruce's lands are extra fertile. Exactly. Oh, I'm out of I'm out of timber. Okay. So this is just a random farm here. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, oh, I see. Oh, I get it. Okay. Farmhouse. Oh, the goods don't transfer over? Wait, what? Hold on a second. Uh, Lassen, thanks for gifting to Ember Fox and Swish. I wish, Tesseract. I wish. Oh. So the goods don't transfer over. So in this area, I have to build another settlers. Huh. Okay. Well, I'll make the settlers camp here. Um, starting supplies. Let's do average. I think we've got... A, do I have enough bread? Okay, there we go. Uh, homeless people's tents, good. So now I should be able to build the farm. That is weird that I can't carry my resources from this town over here to here. So I have to build a storehouse. Hold on. There's so much I have to build now. What is that? Storehouse. A granary. How do you unlock the other settlement types? I don't know. It's a good question, actually. Okay, there they go. So, exposed good granary. 
Oh yeah, I need more burgage plots too. I gotta build burgage plots. Huh, this is interesting. I thought it would combine the two, but it doesn't. My treasury is combined, but not my resources, which is odd. How very strange. How very, very strange. Okay. <laughs> Fizzy Flow, I'm online every day. <laughs> every single day. Uh, okay. Let's build, uh, logging. We have to build a logging camp. I built over a lot of really good farm area here, which is bad. Maybe I put the logging camp here. And then... The woodcutter's lodge. And then I don't need to. I don't need to plant new trees. What? Are, what are we crazy? Okay. Well, let's see how they do. Thankfully, nobody's gotten diseases. People get sick, but they don't get like terrible diseases. Do we have anybody move in yet? That's right, nothing a good bleeding can't fix. <laughs> exactly. Now you're getting the hang of it. Okay, construction finished. Uh, Burgage plot level one. So we got plenty of empty houses here for people to move in. Uh, what do I need? I have to level up these burgage plots, so I need a t somebody in the tavern. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh, the tavern needs needs barley. The tavern needs barley. The mall house needs barley, and barley can only be grown from the stupid farm. So I'm gonna change this to barley. Barley is an, a really annoying to get. There, are, nobody's drinking anything, and has no, nobody's drunk anything for a very long time. Uh, have I been importing barley? I wonder. Oh wait, we had some new people move in. I think. Did, we, did they move in? <gasps> they did. They did. Look at this. So. This is Digital Renegade. This is Merc. This is Seahawks. Have they moved in? Coonrad! Uh, Tech Stag. Let's see here. Tech Stag. Scoot. They're not squatters. They're allowed to be here. Uh, Dank Bong Ripper. Nice, nice. I'm just going to call you Dank Bong for fun. And then also... Uh, Lassen. There we go. Okay, we're all caught up. We're all caught up. No one, I, again, no one has died, which is good. All right, so we got to put one person in the storehouse here, one person in the granary. The woodcutter's lodge. They should be moving them to the granary now. Boy, that's... I thought that was going to be easier. I really thought that was going to be easier to manage a second uh, area, but that is not easier. Family requests more market area for their stall. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, you need a marketplace. That's right. You're right. You do. You need a marketplace. You're right. You guys are right. When you're right, you're right. Uh, marketplace. So. 
Let's do... There we go. And then... They should be moving stuff into there. Exposed goods. Homelessness? Exposed stocks are getting stoked. Well, or soaked. What? Put them in the granary. Put them in the storehouse in the granary, guys. Come on, what are you doing? Put them away. All right, looks like we still need to make more more burgage, more housing. Not enough goods. Okay, well, whatever. Do they not have enough? Are they all full up? <laughs> Fernando said, you know what? This makes me sympathize with the struggles of landlords. <laughs> Good. Landlords have it hard. You want a three second summary? It's a city builder. Uh, how many more logs do I have? Three timber. Okay. Assigned families needed for construction work. I know. So we can get rid of them out of the granary, probably. Oh, well, maybe not. <laughs> are they cheat? Are they in cheat codes? You. What's up, Butta? It is a very pretty uh, world builder. It is. It's true. Really nice. This sucks because this is where I wanted to build my giant farm. I actually did build a giant farm. Uh, let's build a farmhouse here. But I need to build more burgage, more homes for all these whiners. Hold on, let me make sure that I'm not building over too much. This is all really good farmland over here, and this is too. Shit. Oh, settlement level increased. Great. What the... It is very pleasant. The music's great. I think it's on Game Pass, too. That's right, yeah. Alright. So we've got a couple of empty burgages, which is good. And then also, I have a little development point. Establishing a new trade route always costs a maximum of 25. Oh, yeah, that's right. Hold on. Do I have any silver? No. I have 100 silver. That's something. Um, they're probably going to need food. So I'm going to use my... Oh, sheep grazing on pastures slowly multiply? <laughs> oh, heavy plow. No. So the heavy plow should allow me to farm faster. Enables employing oxen at the farmhouse for significantly faster plowing of large fields as well as bringing crops back to storage more efficiently. There we go. Heavy plow. Mr. Natani gifted the CJ Chaos. We can put Mr. Natani in here. 
instead of Heinz. Mr. Natani's right there. He's debranching a tree. Good for him. All right, how's my other settlement doing? Who even really knows what's going on over here? Uh, I'm supposed to level this one up to level three, but I still need barley. <laughs> I still need motherfucking barley, which is so ridiculous. Put one person in the tavern there. This barley is killing me. So what I want to do is start leveling up these burgages, but I need barley because the tavern. Tavern needs a, a steady supply of ale. And then I also need another clothing stall. And the weaver workshop. I have a weaver workshop already built, but I don't know how to give the weaver workshop. Bad Zeno! Gift it to that guy's TV. Let me put Bad Zeno in here. Here's Bad Zeno. There we go. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I need to. I need to make something that makes clothing. Logistics, residential, farming. Maybe I need a pasture. Industry. The Weaver Workshop workers use wool, which is from sheep, to produce yarn and flax to produce linen. I don't know where I get flax either. Oh, Dan Wally, you're very welcome. You're very welcome. Thank you, Dan Wally. I don't I wish I knew where to get flax. Mr. Soup. There we go, Mr. Soup. Mr. Soup gifted Guardian of the Lilies. Hey, what's this? What's that little... Construction finished food stall. This'll do wheat. This'll do flax. Can I transport the flax over? It wouldn't make any sense that I couldn't do this. Here, I'm gonna make flax over here. Right? Why would it why would I be able to make make stuff over here and then not teleport it over to here? Let's make a pasture. Let's make a pasture and put some sheep out there. Pasture space for livestock. go. The music's great, yeah. Um, sheep farm. There we go. Sheep farm's there. Workers collect wool from grazing sheep. Sheep must first be imported via the livestock trader. Oh my gosh, dude. The Livestock Trader. Hold on. How do I do that? Is it at the stable? I can order a new horse or a new ox. Livestock Trading Post. Here we go. Okay. Trade. Trade sheep. Import sheep. It's 30 silver. Alright, chat. Here's another thing that's weird about this game. Sills! Sills gifting to Gustin Sinner, Wust Creative, Ballistic Toaster, and Akodo Roku. Thank you. Sill. Here's another weird thing. It says desired surplus. So when I import one sheep, my desired surplus should be one, correct? The logic, the weird language here does not help me. All right, Sills, we're going to put you into the, the big, 
a big town. Here's Sills. Or Skills, maybe? Now that I type it out. Like, skills, nobody has died. None of my peasants have died. None of my peasants have died, which is pretty amazing. Uh, I don't... So how, do, how often does it, does it trade? How often does the livestock trading post trade? How much do you want to keep for yourself? If you have 140 tools to put 80 desired surplus, the marketplace will sell 60. Well, I'm importing. I'm importing. You see what I'm saying? So importing is different than exporting. Buy until the desired surplus is reached. Okay, so just one. How do I know that I got a sheep? <laughs> I have two horses here, randomly. Yeah, Raven, they, they move relatively quick. I'm an importer, exporter, exactly, Hipcat. Um, how often do I get a sheep? And then does it automatically go to the pasture? I wonder. I have no idea. I'll, you know what? Let's let's import two sheep's. I know the mining pit's full. Exposed stocks are getting soaked. Ah, whatever. How are we doing? Oh, this is all full. Well, almost all full. How are we doing back here? Food four months. Oops. We need somebody farming. <laughs> Whoops. All right, got to build more housing out here. We got some soggy sheep. Hmm. We have one oxen. Great. Food has gone down to three months of food. Oh, I know why. I know why. I have to build... These forager things were worthless to me. So I built a... I think I built a forager and a mining hut over here somewhere, but I don't remember where I built it. <laughs> um... Because I need to be foraging and hunting over here. For this... This town. Because I thought I shared resources, but I do not. Where did I put that? Where did I put those... That, hine, that hunting camp and that... Uh, Forager. I swear I put it on this side, maybe, huh? Oh, there it is. Alright, we're gonna demolish this. I have six months of food over here, which is something. And there's my hunting camp over here. That sucks. This sucks. So I have to be hunting and... So all this good stuff over here is only for this area. Well, that's... No, man. That's a, that's a real bummer, actually. I thought for sure I would be able to share resources and use those resources across two different tiles, but it sounds like I cannot. Uh, okay. Forager hut?
Yeah, Lurky Lou, that's the thing, is it should be all my land. It is all my land, right? I have these two, but now I have to manage two different towns. Oh, I didn't realize that the... It did a little map making, that's fun. As as I fill out the map, it, it does this, but... Uh, I assumed that these resources I could then take and move over here and and grow this settlement. But I don't think that's the case. I'm not sure that that's the case. It, it wouldn't it sort of wouldn't let me, but I don't know. You might be able to trade between towns, yeah. That seems like something I should be able to do, right? <laughs> Enables trading with the visiting traveling merchants, trade points, and trading posts in other regions. Regional wealth is currently used for trade. When employed, one family member travels to nearest possible destination to conduct trade. But, it, like, this to me seems like it doesn't really... It doesn't help at all. It's just sort of... It, you can trade with other regions regardless of whether or not you own them. Which kind of doesn't make any sense. You know? No, we haven't started eating anybody. <laughs> that dude is crushing the flute, it's true. Well, this is weird. I'm gonna run out of food real quick over here. This doesn't make any sense at all. And they're getting this flax, but who knows if I can bring this flax over to the other area. Did I get my sheep yet? Where's my sheep? How am I doing on here? Food, six months of food over here. Oh, I, I made another clothing stall. That's fantastic. Okay, we're getting closer and closer to being able to upgrade these to level three. No, we're not. What am I saying? Why not? Why aren't we not? Why are we not? Firewood stall. Is there only one clothing stall? Clothing stall. Still need tavern, still need barley. Eat ass, not peasants. Wait, hold on. Where's my livestock trading post? Did I get a sheep? I still don't, I have no idea when how I get a sheep. I have no idea. You have to establish a kingdom to be able to rule both towns. Well, I have a manor, if that's what you mean. I have a manor. See. This is weird. This is what I mean. Like that we need like. I need a little more tutorial. When do I get sheep? When does sheep arrive? All right, time them out. You know, here I go. How to sheep. Do I have any sheep in the pasture? Hey, I do. Oh. Margreth. Oh, great. <laughs> Wait, what? Why does it show that I I have sheep here? Apparently, pack stations allow you to barter between settlements you own. Okay, where would that be? Cosmetic. Uh, trade. Trade. There's a livestock trading post and a trading post. Malt house, clay furnace, smithy, bloomery, farming. None of these are 
pack stations, so I don't know. Marketplace, well. Here we go, pack station. Okay, use this building to set up a barter connection, allowing you to send and receive goods between this and another region in your command. Okay, great. Employ mules to transport up to 20 goods per trip. Alright, that's something. Put that there. Stress level high. This is that's the way this game makes me feel, actually. <laughs> Thanks, stress level high. Do we have a are people moving in yet? Here we go. Oh, alright, I just got rid of my uh what I was doing. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so the pack station I can build over there and then one over here as well. I think. Okay. We'll do this over here. Bread. Freshly baked. How are we doing on food? Hey, we're making food actually, finally. Great. So the flax that we make over here, I should be able to then use, put in the pack station and send it over the other way. Twelve months of fuel, so I could probably we got plenty how much how much are we doing on how are we doing on hunting? Hunting's good. How are, how's our berry doing? Berry's good. The flax to linen scheme is coming together, but very slowly. We're making barley on this field. It's going to take 68 days. <laughs> man, oh man, this is just... Any tips to stop procrastination? Do it. Just fucking do it. That's, that's your tip. Here, I'm going to... I'm going to make, I'm going to make a road. Just do it. Watch that Shia LaBeouf video. <laughs> um. Hey, we're making stuff. We're making wool. Great. I still only have one clothing stall. Maybe I need to put one, one more person in the Weaver Workshop then? Yeah, Jix, I know. Like I was saying, that there's just, there just needs to be a lot of a lot of tutorials yet, and that they haven't had yet. All right, well, let's get another sheep then. Let's import another sheep because we only have two, and this this is barely making any uh, any wool. And we only have one clothing stall, so we need in order to upgrade our settlement, the big one. To level three, I need to be upgrading my housing. But in order to upgrade my housing, I need barley for ale. And I need two clothing stalls. So I need a lot more stuff over there. Strike and Lichen. Thank you, Strike and Lichen, for using the Bezos bucks. Uh, let's see here. Let's do Strike and Lichen here.
That's right, I'm stealing from the poor and giving to the rich. <laughs> exactly. Uh, how are they? How are they doing on foraging? I'm doing all right. Okay, let's go check on the other one. So here's the so the pack station's getting built. Four months of food. Forager hut there. Are they? Hopefully they're hunting. Yeah, they are hunting. Great. Terrific. Mosh! What's up, Mosh Dev? Do, 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 do. Of course we're yelling at peasants. We need to... Of course we are. Obviously. So this is my other little settlement over here. Shit, those berries are gonna go away. We need to hurry up and build this fucking stupid forager hut. Hurry up. Build it. It's already July. Hipcads, I'm sh they're alive at least. We're almost out of bread. Hurry! Come on! Build this shit! There. Go forage already, jeez. There they go. Look at the berries are almost down. Go get those berries. We need so many berries! The berries... <laughs> berries support a settlement for so long. <laughs> it's really amazing how long berries support a settlement for. How's my barley doing? Gosh, this is the worst thing in the world. Crop growth at 24... 24%. How's my flax doing? Oh, this isn't... We're not even going to need flax! Ugh. We're not going to get any flax. The flax was at like 38% or something. John G. Wentworth? Hold on a second, John G. Hold on a second, John G. We got some... Here we go. Here's John G right there. Thank you, John G, for coming back for almost four years. The approval rating here is plus two. Just over 50%. <laughs> it's my money and I want it now. Doo, 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 doo. This barley is going to be nothing. I'm going to have like... I've had somebody employed in the malt house. Oh yeah, we are getting some malt. We are getting some malt. Are we getting some wool? No. Do we have any more sheep? We have three sheep. Yeah, we are using money there to import sheep, which is good. Okay. And then this weaver workshop... Should be making something, I hope. That's right, Walker of Tunnels, exactly. Here's my field of barley that's going to yield no barley at all. Do they have it? I have I employed somebody at the tavern, but I don't I feel like they have nothing in the pantry. Yeah, they have <laughs> somebody's been employed at this tavern for so long, <laughs> but nobody's drinking at it <laughs> because there's no ale. The malt house should make the ale. I think that's what we're supposed to be doing here. I wanna say, right? 
industry is the malt house. Workers use barley to produce malt. Needs to be refueled once per month. And then... It doesn't say what... What? Who converts the malt to ale? I know, you're right, Pop Bear. Who converts the malt to ale? This is unbearable. Cloudless, do you convert the malt to ale? Gosh, that, that helps no one. Is there a job for brewmasters? No. Tannery, weaver workshop, dyer's workshop, clay furnace, smithy, or bloomery. No, there is no brew house. There's only a tavern. Alright. Um... Invade a more drunken nation. Is my little pack station? There we go. Pack, pack station's going good over here. How's the flax doing? It's taking a thousand years. Oh no. How's my food doing? Seven months of food though, that's good. Uh, alright. I think we have to employ... I have to employ someone at the pack station. Eventually. What do they need more of, though? They need to forage. Go, go forage. Go for, forage. Alright, hunting limit. When population of a herd drops to this number, workers will stop hunting. Hunt! Dear Lord in Heaven! Bad Zeno gifted to Zeno Tails. Zeno Tails do something nice for somebody else. Come on! Get out there and hunt! And then fuel. We need to probably... How are we doing on logs? We have 54 timber. So let's do this. Let's make it so that people make more firewood. Make some more housing. Road access obstructed. There. Get to building. How's my barley doing? <laughs> it's it's growing so slow. I've got eight malt. I don't know who makes it into tavern though. How's my wool doing? Oh, do I have two clothing stalls? I think I do. What the fuck? Clothing stall supply. I ha I know I have two clothing stalls. I I, I see it right there. I have three clothing stalls. What the fuck is going on? Clothing stall. Is there not room for it or something? No, clothing stall. Clothing stall there. Clothing stall there. Is it being built? No, it's not. Mitchell's peddling. So why does it show me as not having two clothing stalls? Enough supply of any of the following materials on the marketplace. Linen, leather, yarn. Oh, this needs shoes, clothes, or cloaks. 
Uh oh. Bandit camp. Hold on a second. Let me take care of these bandits first. Where are they? Those are different clothing. Where's this bandit camp? There it is. There's two bandit camps. Oh, we just added something to the inventory. Barley. That's great. Who, who makes it? Who makes it into ale? Still invincible. Glad to hear it. Okay, the spear militia is going out. Let's go get these banded camps here. And then, the, so the reason I have to get rid of those banded camps is because the banded camps uh, steal shit from you. You make a level two burgage plot brewery with a family in it. Oh, okay, all right, all right. I, I hear you. Brewery extension. Produces ale from malt. Thank you very much for that, Hunter Force. There we go. Almost out of gold, though. Mosh Dev gifted to Hunter Force. Mosh, do we have you in here yet? I feel like we do. We have you in here. There's Mosh. Mosh Dev. It's when people sub or resub or gift sub. Any of that stuff. Okay, well, I've got two breweries now, so maybe they'll make the stuff. Hopefully. Alright, they're heading out to those bandit camps here. One there, one there. How many more? How many more bandit camps do I need to get? How are we doing back over here? They're slowly building these. Okay, good. How's our food doing? Seven months of food. Or seven months of fuel, actually. Twelve months of food. Fantastic. How's our flax doing? Terrible. Very, very slowly. Yeah, I made a manor a long time ago. Not here on this one, but a manor on the other one. Um, oh, they need a church over here, too? These fucking whiners, man. Oh, these whiners. We're almost out of berries. Hopefully these guys are hunting like crazy. We only have two meat. The population of her drops to this number, her workers will stop hunting. Okay. The church is probably the only place for a drink. <laughs> Feels like it, doesn't it? Uh, where's my hunter? Artisan workshops can some produce, sometimes produce multiple types of goods. Select what good is being produced. Check the general tab in the building panel. The general tab in the building panel. Where the hell? I played nine hours of this game. Oh, wait, they're fighting. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Elder Connell, thanks for the raid, Elder. Yeah! Nice job, boys. Wow. 
and just randomly got into a fight. <laughs> Get those men some ale? We don't have any ale. I don't know how many times I've told you. Alright. Spoils of war. We did it. Treasury? Good. Okay, now let's... Alright. Sent them off to war again. I, don't, I also don't know how to get more of my militia. I'm kind of like... Weirdly, I don't know, I don't know how to do that. would never join an army with no booze. <laughs> Another ruler's army was sighted. Yeah, I haven't yet figured that out. Hurry up! Get to this bandit camp already. Seven course menu is six potatoes and a pint. <laughs> yeah, the, this soundtrack is awesome. It's so good. Oh, they're tired. They're very, very tired. I'm worried that there's going to be... If there's another larger army, I might... I might lose a lot of guys. Scotia! Hold on a sec, Scotia. We gotta name you, we gotta put you into the... Into the housing. Into the peasant housing. <laughs> there we go. Scotia, thanks for being here for three years. You can stop them to get... I know, Pacific Hero, I'm aware, but... If I don't, if I don't keep advancing them, then eventually these bandits will, uh... They'll steal my garbage. And I don't want my garbage stolen. Maybe there won't be any bandits. Maybe we'll be lucky. Go get them, boys. Nice! There was no... Oh, that's awesome. This belongs to me. 170. Pretty good. Okay. That's terrific. All right, we're out of berries over here. 13 months of food and seven months of fuel. That's right. Do not touch thine shit. Sako, if only I controlled that. How do I get a larger army? How do I get a larger army, I wonder? Like, I can... New militia unit, militia footmen... Looks like I have to... I think I have to produce weapons in order to do that. The bandits are going to sign you up for a bunch of credit cards. Yeah, you just need weapons to iron them, I think. I think you're right. Clothing stall supply. Shoes, cloaks, or cloak. Or shoes, clothes, or cloak. Cloaks. Boy, that's hard to say. How in the world... How do I make shoes, clothes, or cloaks? Is that an armorer? Uh, let's see here. Industry. Craft tools. Iron slabs. Play tiles. I don't know what to do here. Shoes, clothes, or cloaks? What makes that? Hmm. 
Yeah, this music is going crazy. Chat, if you uh, if you know, chat, let me know. Cobbler's extension and turn hides into leather to make it. Oh, Clay, I need to make you a, a peasant. That's right. There we go, Clay. Um, cobbler's extension. I have a tannery to make leather. That I have. Uh, cobbler will make shoes. Okay. That makes eggs. That's a brewery. Alright, this will make shoes. Looty! Looty gets the jicks. Hold on a sec, Looty. Here's Looty. Bang, Looty and Clay live together. Um, Jix, do something nice for somebody else. Oh, Jonathan. <laughs> well, all right. Badzino, you know how to make... You can turn hides into leather. But how do I make a... Uh, how do I make clothes? Or cloaks? How do I do that? Are those also extensions? Armor's Workshop. Oh, here it is. Enables production of clothes and cloaks. Terrific. There we go. No, it's not a weaver. It's an extension on housing. This is this is why this game needs tutorials, because like so many of these things are sort of hidden in other areas, you know? Also, no families are moving in, which is weird. Yeah, the learning curve is very strange. It's very, very strange. You're totally right. Still invincible, gifted a fat shark fan. Hold on a second. Still invincible. You're going to be in the other... Uh... What the... There we go. You're going to be in the other town. All right. Cobbler's shop is, is ready to go. So that's good. How are we doing on food? Yeah, Hunter Force. That is a lot to keep track of. It's also, again, everything looks the same. So, it's so like, you can tell that this makes vegetables, right? Barely. <laughs> Who knows what... This is a brewery. Brewery. It's really hard to tell it. They need a, a little different... Uh, is the goal to eventually become like a kingdom or nation? Yes, yes. I have Digital Renegade. You're hidden in here somewhere. No peasants have died. No peasants have died, which is good. You'll not find finer ways anywhere else. Berries. 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 Odin's Udons. Welcome officially to the Gooses. Hold on a second. Odin's Udons. We're going to put you in the other, uh, what's the f uh, fuel used for? Just housing. Every full, every, uh, house needs fuel. Every, every industry needs fuel. There we go. Uh, gooses. Three more people to start the hype train. If we get to the end of a level five hype train. I'm giving away three video games and everybody who subs. Uh, I put into my... I turn into a peasant. <laughs> Alright, I should be able to upgrade this now. Are you fucking kidding me? No? The tavern is supplied. That's something. 
Alright, so the... This needs to make... Huh. Enables production of wooden parts and shields. Let's make let's make war bows. Yeah, it's gonna take a, a moment to supply them. You're right. I can probably uh, expand my marketplace a little bit here. Are we almost out of planks? We are. That's right. I meant to do this. I need to get somebody in there making planks. How's my tavern doing? I think we actually do have barley. Oh, they're making more. They're making more barley. Good for them. This is so weird. Tavern supply. Tailor's shop. This needs another clothing stall. <laughs> the tavern. The tavern's just full of fucking barley. It's true. Thank you, Odin, very much for supporting. Yeah, this is on, it's on early access, but the game's not out yet, so I have I have early access to it. I still don't have a clothing stall. Man oh man. Granary, storehouse, pack station, residential, marketplace. Here we go. We're gonna make a little more uh, area for this this market. Bro, I made a cobbler shop. Vital and Parappa. Vital gifted to Schneebs. Parappa gifted to Peasants Ruin Everything because they do. Hold on. We got it. I think we got some new families in here. Yes, we do. V Why does it do that? Jeez. Here's Vital. What the fuck? There. O L. There. Vital. Jeez. Not enough funds for import. Oh yeah, no, I know. That makes sense. I was importing bread before. And then Parappa. We'll put here. Parappa. Jaded human. Yeah, I know. Winter's approaching. I know. Thank you, jaded human. Gooses, I feel like the... Has the hype train begun yet? It should be real close. Vital, thank you very much for saying that, but every peasant is lazy. Lazy. Every peasant is lazy, including jaded human. There we go. Sin oh, there it is. Sintus gifted to the frozen lake. Sintus, thank you as always. They're moving in. Leslie P. Leslie P. will take the place of Thomas. Thank you, Leslie P. For not, hopefully you're not being lazy. You better you better not be lazy. We're in level one of the hype train. If we get to the end of level five, I'm giving away three video games. <laughs> I've got my own little... Oh yeah, there's another marketplace here. I forgot about that. Three types of food. 
This is so strange. The clothing stalls never arrived. Mosh Dev gifting seven gooses, Regnair, Blocker, Snowman, Droxar, Swigs, Mr. Ruse, and Oriel the Astronaut. Thank you, Mark. Mosh Dev pushed us into level two, level two. Oh, the music's over. Thank you, Mosh. Clothing stall supply. I don't understand. Maybe I have to put it right here. I need five planks. Do I not have five planks? I only have three. Oh, I'm still... Hoodie Harrelson painted forward from Dougie Delicious to Pay to Win Meta. Kid Lear, Hurricane Chapman. Uh, Grey Zagor, Boonavar, and Contasol. Thank you, Hoodie Harrelson. Instead of Koontz, you will be Hoodie. There we go. Brewery. Fletcher Shop, Taylor Shop. This is so confusing. My gosh. Cobbler Shop. I don't, still don't have five, really five planks? Because I think I'm trading away planks or something. Export. No trade. No trade there. There we go. Thank you, hoodie. So if I make another clothing stall here. Let's do this. Good, good old saw pit. <laughs> Listen to that music. There is an active hype train. We're in level two. If we get to the end of level five, I'm going to give away three video games. One of which is any video game at all. Two of which are video games of my choice. How's my flax doing? Zero flax. Great. Fantastic. Just, just fucking great. This is all going to go away in the winter. The peasants might be lazy, but this flautist isn't. <laughs> You're not wrong. He's popping off. We gotta make more housing. crazy. That's a crazy thing that I gotta do. Dave, thanks for the prime, Dave. Dave. Nope, that's not. Why does it do that? Why does it do that every time? 007, there we go.
Oh yeah, unassigned families. That's right. I have no unassigned families for construction. Probably because I have somebody in the saw pit popping off. So I just need more families. Nice try on the hype train, Gooses. It is kind of bard core, yeah. It totally is. I need more families. Real bad. Because everybody's working. Everyone's busy. Currently. Why does the church have a market stall? Oh, that's nice. Look at the... I didn't even notice the water going down the tiles there for a second. That was really nice. We should have enough... Yeah, we have seven months of food, so we're good over there. Let's see how we do. We have nine months of food over here, which is good. Hunter had a top tip for me. Reading up when you assign a house to be an artisan, it removes them from the job market, so it'll be a balancing game. Of yeah, Hunter first. That's what I figured. Yeah, that's what I figured. I just need more more families to move in. I read that earlier. Thank you, Hunter. Yeah. Um, I read that when it popped up, which is really annoying. My gosh. That's a, a lot of balancing. Like the tavern is just, I think, run out. So, like, it doesn't make any sense either. Like, some of these are saying, like, three types of food and then two types of clothing. And again, I'm trying to fill in these these diamonds so that I can upgrade my burgage plot and upgrade my, set, my settlement. But it will not let me. Like, it's refusing. Even though I know that there are two clothing stalls. It just doesn't make any sense. The way that, the way that they have laid this out is so confusing. <laughs> like... It is so, so, so confusing. It says I only, like, it's like, you need another clothing stall. But I have, I have someone making, like, I have a cobbler here. Show workplace. Like, I have a cobbler. But is he not making a market stall? Like, I don't understand. Yeah, Clay, there needs to be a ledger of inputs and outputs. And then I have a Fletcher. But he doesn't make a market stall. It's so confusing. My gosh, is that confusing. Alright, we ran out of malt. We ran out of barley. Do they have the leather? Yeah, they do. <laughs> yeah, Craft Lab, it is driving me crazy. Upgrading to upgrading these to level 3 is proving to be very difficult and doesn't make any sense. Yeah, you just this is what it'll, it'll, Tab does this. Have you tried saving and reloading? You know, I don't saving and reloading like people have been like saving and reloading. I could try, but I don't really know that that's actually going to do anything, so. Come on, come on. Feast your eyes on but I've made a bunch of different, like a tailor, a brewery, a fletcher, a tailor, a cobbler. Like, they should, all of these should be able to put market stalls out. But they are not. Perhaps it was simply a bad batch. These things do happen. So confusing. So, so confusing. My gosh. Idiot Sando gifted to Mimsy. Hold on, Idiot Sando. We're going to put you in one of these bad boys. <laughs> Idiot Sando. There we go. Gifted to Mimsy. No, Kassam. I don't want Takis for dinner. What are you, five? Have you pooped in the fields to make them grow faster? Uh, hmm. Hold on, I gotta name one of these Kassim. Maybe they'll die. Maybe they'll be the only peasant to die. There we go, there's Kassim. Takis are amazing, yeah. Do, 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 do. 
Are we doing on food and fuel? We're doing good over here. Oh, is it not how you spell your name? Too late. I don't care. So you can barter there. Do I have a lot of flax? Seven two berries. <laughs> Fernando. Do you have dye as well as yarn linen? Those appear needed for making cloaks or clothes. Um, dye, you mean, I think dye comes from berries? Is that right? Uh... Still, I'm still not getting anybody moving in over here, which is weird. Workers convert berries into dyes, yeah. This is a, this area of the map is glitched. I should be able to put this down, and I cannot. That's <laughs> really weird. Is the fun worth the confusion? Alec, ye yes, yes. I've been having real trouble. Um, like, I keep running into walls where it's not about, um, it's not about like, oh, that's, good. that's gonna take a long time. Like, it's about like, I don't know that what I'm doing is correct. Um, and that seems to be a pretty major issue. full already. Jeez. But the game is fun. Nice work. Like, I keep thinking about it, and like, last session was great. Last session, like, I totally knew what I was doing. I was... Everything was going well. And then, now I'm just like, at a standstill. It is super chill, yeah. And I, I know once people get a hold of it, they're gonna like... They're gonna really understand it and get it, so... Uh, Rama Remazet or Ramazd, maybe. Let's do. Let's put you in here where Coonrad is. Remazet, there we go. We're out of ale. Sorry, everybody. Whoever's in this tavern, we are. Oh wait, no, there's two ale. <laughs> oh no, it's gone. It's gone. They just drank it. <laughs> they drank it. That's gone. Three types of food in the marketplace? I don't understand. This makes no sense. This makes absolutely no sense. Slayer Demon is doing just fine, Slayer Demon. Viper Spider, I, uh, I think I posted it, Viper Spider? I think it's already on YouTube right now, Viper Spider. Thank you, Slayer Demon, for the 500 bits. This it needs one more food stall, at least three types of food supplied in the marketplace. What does that even mean? What types of food? We have bread, meat, and berries. What's up, Lady Draco? <laughs> All right, these are all building up. That's good. How am I doing over here? These are almost full. Wow. Lots of people moving in. Royal Oss, it's like... I, th I know you can kind of force them to do stuff, but I, don't, I just don't know when. You know? A different type of food? Yeah, I have them. I have three types of food. Oh, Miss Bianca! I saw your uh, donation at the very end of the stream. What did the medieval gynecologist say to his patients? At your cervix, my lady. I hate it, Bianca. 
I hate it. I hate what you said, and I hate what you did, and I hate what you stand for. Um, <laughs> Marius Raptor. Good to see you, Marius. There you go. Marius, thanks for being here almost. We're going on six now? Six years? No, it's not funny. <laughs> oh, I hear somebody banging on my door. I think I need a saw pit. Dad jokes are not the best, chat. I hear somebody banging on my door. Who knows when it'll happen? Look at them all. Is that a, looks like they're building a graveyard. What are they doing? Hold on a second. Hold on a second, chat. Hold on. I got a visitor. I've got a visitor. <laughs> what? Oh, she sees Scary Man on the ground. <laughs> you waving at everybody? Casim said, "Who's that?" Hey, you touch my. Kassim is obsessed with me. Thank you. You literally see. <laughs> no. Huh. Scary man. Hi, scary man. <laughs> is she waving? At yeah, she's waving at the emperor. <laughs> Hi, scary man. Hi, baby Yoda. <laughs> Hi, Batman. Who do you see? Helldiver? Hi, scary man. Can you wave at everybody? Wave at yourself. Wave at everybody. What does that? <laughs> That's you. Hi. Oh, there's mom. Oh, she said ma? Scary man. Hi, scary man. That's. It's the Emperor, chat. There's a mask of the Emperor on the floor. Baby? 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 No. no. Emperor. <laughs> Emperor. He goes, Emperor Palpatine? <laughs> You're banging on my door. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You're the greatest. Hey, don't do that. She's trying to charm you so she can eat your microphone. You want to give dad one more hug? Can I have a big hug? Can I have a big hug, bub? She sees the emperor. Can I have a big hug? One more hug and then we go. That's right, Baby Yoda and Batman. Have a big hug. Have a big hug, Bob. Oh, never mind. <laughs> she just wants to look at him. Come here. Bye, Bye. 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 She's banging on my door. She's banging on my door, chat. What the heck? Pokemon Master, we're very, very lucky that she's so cute. Bye. She's just about a year. Just about a year. 
Thank you, Pokemon Master. Do, 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 do. Why is she? Be oh, she messed up my microphone. Guys, I live the hardest life. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. That's a joke. <laughs> Does she call you Liberator? I love it. She started giving hugs randomly, which is amazing. It's um when she gives you a hug randomly, it's the best feeling in the in the world. Hipcats, it's okay. That's all right. It's the best feeling in the world. Does she know I'm a Republican? Kasim, we know you're the Republican. Everyone knows that you are the right wing nut. <laughs> All right. Hold on, I gotta name some more gooses here. Oh no, Koontz is sick! Who's gonna get sick? Who did I have? Stexon. Stexon's gonna be sick. There we go. Slayer Demon, thanks for gifting a sub, by the way, Slayer Demon. Again. Jungle Boogie. Will be there. He'll, Jungle Boogie will be just fine. Slayer Demon also with a with 1000 bits as well. 1000 of them after gifting a sub. How much do I love Manor Lords? 1 to 1 million. I think this game so far is about an 8 out of 10. I think it needs some real work when it comes to knowing what I'm doing and why, like tutorials and stuff, but uh, generally speaking it's really really fun and very well and and well made. It just needs some needs some direction. That's all. It just needs like a lot, lots and lots of tutorials. Yeah, when she bangs on the door like that, I gotta let her in. When I hear my little daughter banging on the door, I got, I gotta let her in. I don't have a choice. Um, I don't have a choice, guys. Got to do it. Okay. Back to the video game. Is this a beta? No, I, th I think it's gonna go to early access. I don't, I don't actually. Maybe you know, what? it might be a full release. I don't, I truly don't know. I know it's coming to Game Pass. Um, okay, the Dyer's Workshop is done over here. So maybe I can put someone in the Dyer's Workshop. There we go. We got people moving in here. <laughs> Merc. Uh, let's, let's do more housing over here. No. Oh, I see. Is, it, is that right? Okay. The Fallout show is great. Man, it's so good. Like, actually way better than it has any right to be. Like, way better. Um, it's so much fun to watch. Don't be shy, good sirs and ladies. It says early access on Steam. Yeah, the, uh, I have early, like actual, actual early access. Meaning, like, literally early access to this. Because nobody can play it right now. Um. That's why I call it early access. Because it literally is early access. Uh, okay. Can you give feedback to the devs? Moshtev, I don't know. I have not been invited to do that, so I won't, I probably won't do that. Food stall is driving me insane. Three types of food supplied on the marketplace. I know I have that. I know I have that. Because I have a food cart that brings in bread. What other food could there possibly be besides hunting and berries? What other food? A bandit camp? All right, hold on. Uh, way up there.
eggs and veggies. I have... I've made... Uh, different burgages have places for eggs. So I don't know... I don't know if there's a good place to look at what... Let's see here. Two meat, 180 berries, six eggs. So I have three types of food on the market. Or three types of food there. Gosh, man, I, this is just driving me insane. So this also has three... See, look. This has three food stalls. But not one... Not another clothing stall. This is what I mean. These requirements are driving me crazy. Because one burgage that's right here... One burgage that's right here has everything it needs except for one clothing stall. But then this burgage has two clothing stalls and is missing a food stall. I don't understand. Close to each other, they're right next door. They're three houses down. Yeah, they're three houses down and they're right in front of the marketplace. Look. That's what I'm trying to say. Like, how close does it need to be? They're right there. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. It really makes no sense at all. I, I'm. I have. I, I don't know. I don't know how to solve it. I really don't. Um. Because you can't force anybody to do anything, so you can only build. Uh, maybe not producing enough clothes, but they are in other bur other burgages. Other burgages. See, look. Oh wait. Not enough wealth. This one I can finally upgrade. Okay. There's one that I can upgrade, but I don't have enough fucking gold. Shit. Um, I'm, I've been importing barley, which I need, actually. The supply quantity over time took a bit? No, because, like, some of these just don't fill. See, like, some of them just don't fill. I, it's so strange. Yeah, if it's a proximity, a proximity thing, we need to know the range. Exactly. Exactly. Like this, look at guys, this one, th three types of food supply on the marketplace, right? The food stall supply needs one food stall supply here. This burger is next door to the marketplace. It doesn't make any sense. It makes no sense. Okay. What are we doing here? Oh, I need more burgages. Lots more burgages. Okay. Lots more burgages over here, meaning housing. Let's do... Mate! Get your mate here! Maybe available supply. Perhaps what supply there is taken up by other buildings. I mean, easy again. I don't. I don't know. There's nothing indicating that, right? So, yeah, bad Zeno. It's crazy. It, there's that, the problem is, is that none of that is indicated by what you need to. Like, if it if it was telling me how to fix it, I would totally fix it. But some of them are full, and some of them are not. Yeah, you can speed up time, just like in most city builders. Uh. All right, what am I... Let's see here. I'm going to do a saw pit here. How are we doing on logs? Uh, forager we're going crazy on. Woodcutter we're going crazy on. How are we doing on fuel? Nine months of fuel? Okay. I assume you're producing some and it's not enough for the whole, all the houses. Maybe. <laughs> but you don't actually know. <laughs> so that's the problem. Um, Alright, I just need to upgrade some burgages here in front of the, the market. So let's... Oh, it... I need four. Oh, no. 
I hear combat. There they are. Oh no, they're fighting. No. No. Shit. And my other... Uh, no, the, the game is great. Like, there's there's clearly greatness here at the, at the game. It's just... There's just a lot of things that need to be fixed. Have at thee! Come on, boys. Uh-oh, we lost another man. If only this, these other people would actually show up. They're taking fucking forever. <laughs> Those two in the back cheering. There we go. Killed them. Do the graves say who died? Well, this, thankfully these aren't peasants, so none of the subs have died. These are just, like, my militia. Get in there. Fight him. Come on. Show him who's boss. Yeah, Corbin, absolutely. Absolutely, Corbin. Ah! Way to go, everybody! Now, take the bandit camp! And these... The reason you have to go out and, like, deal with these bandit camps right away is because... Uh, they start stealing your stuff otherwise. So you have to you have to go and deal with them right away. You do not have a choice. I did it. This belongs to my treasury. Oh, I have more influence. I'm gonna send them back. Uh let's send them back here. I can actually, I think, take another tile. Let's see. Claim with... Oh, no, this is 2,000. Claim with influence is 2,000. Holy shit. Oh, I can claim this, though. Ooh. I don't... Everything looks the same. Like, there's really no... There's no disadvantage. I also don't know why I would do this. Cloudless, ew. All right, well, I'll claim the I'll claim this other. I guess this is good. A trade point, cheap goods for import, good value to export, work in progress. Okay, well, they're they're working on it. Let's do this. All right, claiming, claiming, I'm doing it. Uh. How are we doing over here? I don't want to look at Zwayo. I want to look at the... Uh... Oh, that's broken. So, when I move to different tiles, it should show me what... Oh, here we go. There we go. Gold off. Okay. Um... What do you think? Can I finally do this now? Not enough wealth. What am I spending that money on? Barley, probably? <laughs> oh, shit! I'm trading barley just to have... Just to have... Uh... Beer. Oh. 
And I'm wasting the money I get every month. Oh my gosh. I guess I, just, I probably don't need to import meat anymore. Well, maybe I do. Where's my hunter? Where's my hunter area? Hunting camp. How are we doing on the hunting? They're, do they're doing it. What? What the hell? Why are they way up there? What are you doing? Go hunt over here. What the hell? You crazy hunters? Trade. All right, I'm no longer importing meat. No trade. I need the stupid barley. Why are they why were they hunting way over there? Waiting? I am so confused by this. Like, look at him. Why is he all the way up here? <laughs> What are they waiting for? This is so weird. What are they doing? All right, well, I got that tile. That's good. That's something. Now I have three tiles. But now each tile requires me to build another settlement there and start from scratch, which is really interesting. Uh. That's very, very odd. And I'm running out of food. Of course I am. Of course I am. Uh, forager hut? Where are these? Are they foraging in the right place? How's my how's my barley field doing? Starting from scratch yet again? <laughs> Bojangle. All right, let's. I like this settlement better, honestly. These people are more proactive over here. How are we doing? Food, eight months of fu food and fuel. I like what they're doing. No flax, of course. Because why would I have flax? <laughs> I made a set up that flax farm so long ago. No, it's not playable. Playable in like 10 days. How's my tavern doing? All right. Well, I need to upgrade three Burgage plots to level three. Yeah, you know what? You guys are right. It just takes them forever. It takes the peasants forever to learn their trade. That's what's happening. I also I still don't know what to do with my treasury. It can be used for diplomacy, hiring retinue and mercenaries, as well as settling a new region. AI, all right. Market can be finicky. Just grab a stack of one item. Can fiddle with what they're selling. I think it seems to be limiting your plots. Yeah, I know. Morvik gets really, really convoluted and confusing. Um, very convoluted and confusing. Are they actually foraging the right berries? Damn it! Are there will work for beer signs? Didn't I make a... Yeah, here's the forager hunt. All right, I probably got to build more burgages. More housing for these damn lazy hell damn... Lazy hell damn... Lazies... Lazies dams. These stupid peasants.
<sighs> yeah, Sin, absolutely. The graphics in this game are great. Here, I haven't even done this. Look. Look, I can, this is this is me running around. I can go take a look at uh, what everybody's doing at the, at the marketplace. This is the coolest part. Don't be shy, good sirs and ladies. Yeah, the music's great. Get to work. Hurry up and sell your berries. You think I can? I mean, there's nothing I can do. Reassign. So there's nothing I can do with these. The, the stalls pop up. The marketplace stalls up, pop up on their own. So, I mean, like, I can look at them to see what they're doing, but there's nothing I can do. No, it's there is no first person gameplay. No. Um. Okay. How are my hunters doing? Are they actually hunting in the right spot? Like they weren't before? Because they're stupid? Do you know if this will have multiplayer? No, as far as I know, no. I think this, this is all single player. And it should be on... Uh, it should be on Game Pass as well. Don't be shy, good sirs and ladies. It's so weird. These hunters just don't do anything. That seems really glitched. They need to work on, like... They need to work on the hunters, because, like... The hunting camp is, like, always really hit or miss. Like, I have six people hunting. Kyle, Slayer, Demon, Technics, Kenny V, Ice Cool, and B-Bowers, and there's only one person walking up and down. Like, it doesn't make any sense. It makes no sense. When population of a herd drops to this number, workers will stop hunting. Make the hunting area bigger? Yeah, no, I, I mean, I, you can't. You, you can do this. I can do limit work area and this. This is it. This is the circle I, have, I am given. So I can put them here. But then if I, for example, clear the work area, the unlimited work area, let's see where they go. They just stand there. See? Unlimited work area. Oh, you mean this? You think this is going to help me? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> they, they don't even go anywhere near there. <laughs> I have the one guy that does it. But the rest of them are just going back and forth on the... That's what I'm trying to say, is that, like, it just seems glitched. <laughs> yeah, the, the UI is not going to make a difference. It's just, it's something that I've had a, a major problem with for a, a very long time. The hunters have always been not, not doing... I mean, like, also, generally speaking, hunters, if it's a video game, right, the AI would go to this area where the wild animals are. Um, but they don't. They, like, wander around the town and stuff. <laughs> I mean, look at them. I, it's very it's very odd, right? It, it, yeah, I did look at the... I did read the UI, Spark. Thank you. <laughs> so it's very strange. It's, uh... <laughs> That's, uh... Did you read the UI? They're, maybe they're hunting for women to start families. Or hunting for kids, maybe. Maybe that's what it is. I heard some people had to save and reload to the main menu to fix some AI issues with people. Yeah, mouse hacks, I've been doing that here. I'll do that again, but um, we'll do it for just to see. But uh, I can just load, reload the game and see. I haven't tried that during a session, so um, we'll see. I don't know. It, uh, since it is early access, I think it's probably having a few issues here and there. Um. But here they are. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll do it again. Let's put it right... 
I don't know how big the actual hunting area is. Hold on. See, like, this has a... Uh, it should have lines around it. I saw lines on, on the wild animal area, but... I've never played Anno, so I don't know how, it's, how, how uh, it compares to Anno. See, I can do this. Maybe that'll do it. Maybe then they'll go hunt. And also it's at 10 out of 20, but I have the limit at four. Yeah, four out of 20. Maybe put the camp outside the town. It doesn't matter. Uh, there they go. It's really weird. Isn't that weird? Here, I'll, I'll move it, yeah. Uh, let's do, uh, let's do a hunting camp up here. Give them less time off? Boy, if only I could. <laughs> if only I could. Anything in particular you find the game does really well. Um, hmm. Really well. The the graphics and music are really, really great and fun. I love seeing the, there's a lot of realism to it, which I appreciate. No, market's not full. I have three I have three different markets. Uh okay, let's see here. Where's that bandit camp? There's another one up there. Ooh. Oh shit. Hold on a second. I might have to hire some mercenaries. Um where are they gonna attack? These brigands. There's 18, there's uh 18 times 3. What's that? 36 plus another 18. <laughs> I might have to hire some mercenaries. Um The Wayward Sons. Let's put these guys... Let's send them after this bandit camp here. And then... Where do they... Uh, where do the bandits... The bandits, I think, come from the bottom, I want to say. Oh they're, oh, they're there. Actually, let's go. Let's see if we can meet them up here. Let's see how that does. Oh, no, that's that's a that's a mighty fighting force there. I never played banished either. 18 times four, pardon me, which is exactly the same. Uh. Here, let's put them up here. I know an enemy unit has been spotted. I know. 72 versus 72, exactly. I know I'm scared. And we need to set these guys up. Stand your ground here. And then hopefully they get their stamina back. And then hold on, these guys are on the way up there too for the, the bandit camp. All right, I've got two fighting forces.
gas them. Okay. I know an enemy unit's been spotted. I need them to get their fatigue back. I think that they're... I think they're all... It looks like these brigands are all melee, which is good. That's a, that's a mighty fighting force of brigands. Um, and then these guys are all, uh, these are all at least, they're, they can fire arrows. Hold on, what's happening? Why do I keep getting the enemy unit has been spotted? Alright, here we go. There they go, they're firing. Nice. Well, that's not working at all, is it? All right. Well, that's doing doing a little bit of damage. Oh no! What's gonna happen when they? Come on, boys! All right. Th thankfully, these are flanking. This is this is actually working. These are flanking over here. Wait, what happened? What did that mean? Oh, they're trying to run away. Kill him! What's going on? What the fuck just happened there? I won, but I think I won. It plays that. There we go. It plays that sound every time I beat a, one of the fighting forces. So I think that's what happened. Okay. They've been disbanded. Where am I? Where's my other fighting for? Oh, geez. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Stand your ground, boys. Here come the brigands. How are the controls? They're good. The controls are actually pretty good. There's a lot of management par uh, parts of these games that are, are very confusing, but the controls are solid. All right, boys, get ready. Get ready. Here they come. Kasim, you, you don't even have access. Dan Wally! Oh, Dan Wally, congratulations on your successful tax day. Boy, you waited till the very last day. <laughs> the very last day, good for you. This is going to be a tough fight, I want to say. Well, no, their effectiveness is, is much better, so this is good. Hello? Push up and attack. What are you doing? What is this one guy doing? What is this guy? This one dude. No one's died? He's the bard. How is no one die? There we go. Jeez. <laughs> Artrius. Come on, boys. <laughs> My knee. 
Come on, break their spirits. Tell them you fucked their wives. Shout insults at them. Talk about how ugly they are. Say their noses are too big. Their penises are small. All right, we're about to win. We're about to win and we didn't lose any any men. Yeah. Good for you guys. Way to go. We lost no one. Yes, sire. Now go take that bandit camp. Oh, look at all that influence I picked up randomly all of a sudden. 1.9k, wow. Slayer Demon, he's such a lazy hunter. Such a lazy hunter. Salvage the dead for food. Do you choose what faction you wish to start with? Uh, no, it's not. There's no real factions. It's just like you basically just start a, a city from scratch. This belongs to my treasury now. All right, uh, let's send them back home. And then... So the hunting is working over here. It's still no one's hunting. I am so, so confused, my gosh. Jeez. Still nobody is hunting. I'm gonna get rid of this this uh, this hunting camp. I hunting camp. I, I can't stand it. It's making me so upset. It's making me so upset. No one's doing anything. Are you actually hunting? What the fuck? What are they doing out there? The hunting is right here! Is the hunting camp only employing vegans? It's right there! Uh, all right. Am I able to upgrade this? No, of course not. It's because I've run out of... I've run out of barley. <laughs> I've fucking run out of barley. Because the tavern doesn't have a supply of ale. Fantastic. Because before I was importing barley... <laughs> we must hunt for barley. I guess, you know what? This is going to be, I'm going to make, I'm going to make another giant farm then. Uh, here, this is our giant barley farm. Barley. But I still don't even know how to get, how to send this stuff over. There's nothing in the generic storage of the pantry. It's so, so confusing. Are they hunting up there? Kind of. This is almost full. That's good. Uh, Woodcutter's Lodge. We're doing good on that. So I can send stuff to Goldhoff, but I need Barley to send it. <laughs> Our Barley crops will be the talk of Lord Kassam's town. I need to upgrade... two Burgage plots. So... Oh, nope. I can't do it. Because I need timber? The fuck? I've got 30 timber. 
Unlocks new extensions. Oh, I need. Oh, I need a well. Whoops. I need a well and what? Uh, and a ch and church. <laughs> I never had a well out there. Granary, storehouse, pack station. Oopsies. Requires underground water. Oh. Yeah, who, yeah, exactly. Who needs water when you have ale? Oh, there's a stone pit way down over here. Let's see here. Where's this road? Make a road to the stone pit. Uh, and then let's make a stone cutter camp out here. Okay, what else do we need? Water access, church level, and the clothing stall supply. All right, so we gotta make clothing stall. Uh, which would be a tannery. There we go. They're building the church. Good job, everybody. Oh, this town doesn't have any taxes. That's right. I need to... Oh, I need to institute some taxes. Oh, I can't yet. Okay. Casim, I have Prima Nocta in my town. <laughs> I gotta start taxing. Hey, they're doing it. They're actually doing it. Wow. I don't know where the flax is going. I don't... Are we making any flax at all? Okay, we're about to crop growth. 93%. Okay, good. Man, what the fuck? Tax me harder, daddy. You have to pay taxes. Uh... What? Why does this have... What are you, what are you whining about? Okay, um, still not hunting, by the way. We got one, one up there. They keep hunting over here for some reason. I have no idea why. Uh, the forager hut. We only have five months of food, so I guess I'll do another forager there. They should be cr going crazy on this berry deposit. Look, it's totally full. You can select the hunting area under the advanced tab. We already tried it twice, but I'll do it again. I'll do it again. <laughs> Look at this. Bang. Let's do it again. Why not? Yeah, what are the berry miners doing? Look, look, they all run down here. I don't know. I'm not sure. Tavern supply, still low. I need to be importing some barley, finally.
I think that's going to take a while to fill up the tavern. I know, it's good. It's a good bustling town, though. It doesn't make any sense why they're not hunting this thing. I can't, I can't figure it out. Look at... They should be up there, and they're not. It's so weird. It's so strange. I don't get it. <laughs> Jorge. Because <laughs> they're hunting down here. Oh, are they finally going to go? No. Well, what are they? Why is this one going down here when I when I put the work area up there? I don't know. I don't know. It's glitched. It's for sure glitched. This is working over here. This hunting camp is going over here. They're doing a great job. Did I figure out the firewood issue? Yes. That was just thankfully firewood is just build more woodcutters lodges. Um. All right. This. I need a clothing stall. I need a clothing stall. Wild animals have migrated. What does that mean? Um, so I built a tannery. Oh, I need to put somebody in it. Put somebody in the church. Let's put the tavern right next to the tannery. Uh... Oh, I'm sorry. Tavern right next to the church. There we go. Maybe they need a road. They have a road. <laughs> they have a road. I put. I, that was one of the first things I did. Oh, they, hey, they, the animals actually moved. Look at that. Um, but I'll uh, make another road to the new area. There we go. Maybe they're actually going to go over there now. Why do I have to carry this alone? What sets this game apart from all the other co colonizing games? Um, colonizing games are a lot like survival games. Where like... Uh, if there is... If there's enough of a hook to keep you playing it, then it's really fun. But if they don't reward your time with upgrades and like things that get better and better, then eventually you start to go, ah, this isn't worth it. So, my approval's way up over here, yeah, but that's because I'm nobody's getting taxed. Um Let's build some more housing. Is this more like a building sim or colonizing? It's it. This is a city builder. It's what's what's called a city builder. Yeah, my approval rating is going great. It's popping off over here, which is good. All right, we can level this up. I think I only need to do this twice, though. Building stall supply. Have I tried the combat? Yeah, mu much of it. Yeah. Combat's okay. It's fine. Uh, okay. The Weaver Workshop. Oh, I should probably make this, actually, because we have flax. We actually do have flax. Yeah, I can show some of the town in third person. Absolutely. Let me show the bigger town here. Um, it's really... It's it's super well done. Like, It looks really cool. Because everybody's doing their job. Here's the little marketplace. Yeah, it's really neat. The third person is only for fun. Like, this, it, you don't do anything in the third person. But it's really cool. 
In third person, you should follow your hunters. I know, right? Yeah, it's pretty neat. So there's lots of really fun stuff to like about it. But the resource, resources and stuff is really thoroughly confusing right now. Uh, let's see here. How are my hunters doing? What do we, what do we think? They're still set, They're still walking south. I don't know what they're doing. I keep telling them to go up here and they won't go up there. There's a road and everything. It doesn't make any sense. It's so weird. It's so strange. I don't get it. Second hunting camp? <laughs> I already tried that. I had two of them. It doesn't matter. Maybe the road is haunted. Uh, let's see here. Moist bison. Oh, you know what? Hold, hold on, moist bison. Moist bison is there now. Maybe raise the hunting cap? Already did. Doesn't matter. Look. Wild animals. 21 out of 20. That's a glitch, obviously. But then with the hunting camp, I have the hunting limit as 4. And what I mean by that is when population of a herd drops to this number, workers will stop hunting. So when it drops to 4, they should stop hunting. But it's currently at 21 out of 20. See, I don't know. It's it's really it's super wonk. It's clearly broken. Uh, can I upgrade this finally? This fucking tavern. My gosh. Holy shit. This motherfucking tavern. Well, it all filled out at least. Well, no, not these. <laughs> is the fighting in this game as de in depth as the management? I don't think so. I think you probably could make it a little more in depth, but I've I've not had to, which is fine. Okay, import more barley so we can finally build, I can finally upgrade these things. This, this settlement's doing way better, honestly. Uh, okay. Still low on food though. Can I... It's been uh, subs or resubs or gift subs. That's not, that's who I'm dropping in there, Rotorbone. The tavern. I guess I need. Do I need an, a malt? A malt house, probably? Let's put the malt house here. Rotorbones gifted to 8-7 Gaming. Rotorbones, you're officially living with coots. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> you and coots. What's up, Connor? Berries, berries, bursting with flavor. Fresh, fresh meat. meat. Get your fresh meat here. Why? Somebody's going to do some construction on this eventually. I just don't know when. Can I be an ox? I, that I'm not sure. Hold on. 
Nah, Rotor Bones, you're already, you're already there. You're already there. Kento the most excited. Actually, no, I didn't even know that, and nor do I care. Uh... Deforestation killed berry bushes. Great. Fucking great. Oh, I need more fuel. Cloudless. Yeah, the music's awesome. Can you fish? Not that I've seen, though. Come on, guys. Upgrade the burgage already. Get to it. Why are they taking so long? Everybody's just standing around. Yeah, the berries are... The berry deposit is now gone. But thankfully, we have 14 months of, of food. So we, we'll be fine on that front. I need more fuel, though. Why did they just give up? What happened? Come on, get to it! Get to it! All right. Oh, yeah, fishmongers would be great. Hey, what do you think? Do you think they're hunting? No. They're always... Well, maybe they were. Maybe they were hunting. Only five months of food. Yet again. Goose, is the hype train is all set to go? The hype train is all set to go. If you want me to give away three video games, it's ready to go. I'm giving away any video game at all. I'm giving away a copy of a video game that I like, and I'll give away a copy of Manor Lords. It's not even buyable yet. Um, still no tavern, huh? Do we have a? Do we have any ale? Per chance. It's my favorite type of game. I don't really have a favorite type of game. Uh, okay. Let's see here. One thing I haven't built. I have not built a thing that allows for. Workers convert iron ore into iron slabs. I haven't built a mining thing for this. No deposit in range. Then I can build a road out to it. Still need more food, though. This barley field is giving me 0% barley. Step right up and Zero. Be shy, good sirs and ladies. Fine. Jeez, just do wheat. Goodness gracious. Yeah, you can do crop rotation with these fields. This it's just like ridiculous, guys. Four percent flax. We'll do some barley here. Oh, I think we're actually harvesting barley. We have two flax. I got two flax from this giant fucking field. Um, holy shit, dude. Oh, 
Halacious Whiskey. Hold on, Halacious Whiskey. Let's put you in here. Halacious. Bang. Thank you, Halacious Whiskey, for the prime. Four more people to start the hype train, Gooses. Uh, let's see here. They're building burgage plots. Wow, this town is really filling out nice. There she goes. Okay. Um. So I got the heavy plow that didn't help me at all. Holy fuck. Produces apples. Slayer Demon gifted two gooses. Michael Lee Hacks and Addy Vic Gaming. Thank you, Slayer Demon. Slayer Demon is still one of my lazy hunters out there. Doubles capacity of all berry deposits. I really always need that. I don't think I can... Wild animals on rich deposits breed twice as fast. The cost of 50% reduced yields from your crops. Citizens skip every fifth meal. <laughs> Slayer Demon, everybody's disappointed in them. Oh wow, why don't I have... I'm gonna... No storage space left for hunting camp. For hu hunting camp? Okay, I guess that's good. Are they finally doing it? No, they're still down here for some reason. What? In the shit? Oh. Oh my gosh. All the requirements are met to upgrade this to level three, but I don't have enough silver because I spent the silver on barley. To import the stupid fucking barley. I just have to wait. Here, hold on. No, I can't do it yet. Gosh, man. This is driving me insane. I just need this to go up. It's at 23. I need it to go over 25. Brother. Does my guy like beer? Yes, I'm sure he does. Stocks damaged by weather. I don't care. Boy, do I not care. They went down to 21. They went down. I have to go to the bathroom.
I'm gonna throw I'm gonna throw my computer out the window. I'm gonna throw my computer out the window right now. Cause they I I need barley so bad. I need I need it so bad, chat. Someone get me barley, please. David, thank you, David. Nope, 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 nope. No. Okay, all right, all right. David Zhao. There you go, David. I wish I was pooping. I'm so mad. I'm so mad about the fact that all I need is 25 whatever. Oh, guess what? The tavern supply is now low. Is there a way to play this game now? No. No, there is not. <laughs> Cyberfisher. Does this game re get repetitive? You know, one thing, it has not gotten repetitive. But it's been absolutely maddening. We're still at 21 regional wealth. Nine. I don't know why we just lost... I don't know why I just lost money. I don't know. I have no idea. I can't figure it out. I have no idea. Maybe it's because I'm importing. I have no idea. Let's do... Let's let's export some stone. I think I've got a ton of stone. We'll export some planks, too. I already have these people taxed. Like, I feel bad. How are we doing on food over here? 12 months of food, okay. I think I need to build another woodcutter camp, I want to say. I have the silver only in this. Hold on, look. Wait, I think I have the silver. It changes, right? It changes per region, so I think I have, I have the silver now because of the importing and exporting. So... Good news, guys. I'm out of barley. I'm out of barley. So I have the silver, but I don't have any barley. So the tavern is not supplied. So I cannot upgrade because the tavern does not have barley. I'm going to shit a brick. I'm going to absolutely shit a brick. It's crazy. Somnawak, hold on, hold on, Somnawak. Put you in there with rotor bones. There we go, and Somnawak. Thanks for the prime, and Somnawak. Uh, what did I want to build? Oh, a woodcutter's lodge. That's right. There you go, Insomniac. Oh, they're moving in. Do we have any... I think we have... Oh, we have we don't have lots of empty places, but it's just like Age of Empires. No, it's not a 4x. It's not a 4x. Oh my gosh, I'm I can do it. I can finally do it. Holy shit, I can finally do it. I can't believe it. I need to upgrade three of those burgage plots. 
I'm out of gold. I need to... I, I only did one, though. They're doing it. It's finally turning... It's finally upgrading. This took... Three hours to get to. It looks great. It looks fantastic. Look at that. No, I need another food stall. Why do I need another food stall? What the fuck does that even mean? It was just the requirements were just there before. What happened? Why are they not there anymore? That doesn't even make any sense. Why would the food stall all of a sudden... So... When you, le when you level up three burgage plots, level three or higher, then you get another... It levels up your settlement. Um, and then you, you get like... You can probably sign more policies and then you get another skill point and shit like that. Uh, what did I want to do here? I think I have been mining... Yep, I have been mining. Good. Convert iron ore into iron slabs. And then... Workers use iron slabs to craft tools. There we go. Okay. I probably need to build more housing as well. Like this game could could be a lot easier than it is in the sense that they've made th they made everything very difficult, <laughs> like really, really difficult. Six? Six thumbs? What's, what's this thumbs down bullshit? What are, you, what are you whining about? Five months of food still and fuel eight months. Okay. And then those make tools. I still I don't know what tools do. I have yet to figure out what actually what how that helps me. Workers use iron slabs to craft tools, but I don't know why. I'm not sure why. They're still not hunting this area, by the way. Still not doing it. <laughs> still not hunting the area. That is so glitched. It's so glitched. Resource stolen by bandits? Oh. Oh, this motherfucking bandits. Okay. I gotta stop here. Ugh.